welcome once again to another edition of the Red Run and Williams Real Estate Show. I'm Shannon Deskins along with Jennifer Brown Day and it's a brand new year. 2019 is here. It's here finally. <laughs> it seems like we talked for a long time about the year is ending. Where did the year gone? Well, it's gone, but the good thing is you've got a clean slate for a brand new year. Absolutely. It's a brand new year and I'm talking about it in the Real Estate Minute, but of course it's a brand new year, new goals, hopefully a new house. Whether you want to buy a house or sell a house, mm -hmm. 2019 might be your year. We hope so. <laughs> All right, so we're going to give you five listings that if you're on the looking side of that, you may, you may find something that, that you want to look a little bit closer at. And the first one of those uh, is in the Mullins area of Pike mm -hmm. County. It is. This one is on Mullins Hill, which if you're familiar with the old Mullins School or what is now North Point Academy, you're directly across US 23. Up on Mullins Hill is where this is located. And this is going to be a great opportunity for somebody because you're getting, this is a duplex, so you've got two separate units. Each one has two bedrooms and two bathrooms. Um, but the price is great on this because it's a foreclosure, so huge opportunity here. It is. It's a great investment opportunity. Like you said, it is a foreclosure, so this house comes with no guarantees, no warranties. It's being sold as is. You've got great big rooms. The kitchens in both of the um, units is mm -hmm. really nice size. The bedrooms have cathedral ceilings, and I think we've got one of the pictures. You can see the maroon picture right. with that detailing up on the ceiling. That is wood beams, and each bedroom has an attached bathroom. So wow. it has a lot of potential for investment. When this was built, somebody really wanted to make it feel like you had a lot more square footage than you, than you technically do on paper. Absolutely. In total, you're right under 2,800 square feet for both units together. So about half that is going to be what's on each side. And then there is no access from one to the other. So this is a complete duplex. Mm -hmm. If you wanted to open it up, I'm sure there are ways that you could go in and do that. But right now it is a complete duplex with an entrance on the front and an entrance on the back and completely separated units. Wow, so this is one you could look at a couple different ways. If you're looking into just investment property, uh, you can buy this, fix it up, and you can lease or rent both units. Or you can buy one to live in one and then you know earn income on the other side. So there are so many different opportunities. And the price on this one, 84.9. So you're getting the property, which is a third of an acre, which is pretty big when you when you sit down and look at property size. Mm -hmm. All right, now this is one that that you personally are taking care mm -hmm. of, and this is a brand new listing. It so is. So things like this traditionally I wouldn't think stay on the market very long. Not very often. <laughs> right. So this is one you want to move on quickly if if you're interested in this. Jennifer, let's give the Pikeville office number. Okay, that number six zero six four three seven two three three three. All right, now. From where that is, just let's go south on US 23, just a couple of miles. This one is one we've talked about before on mm -hmm. Lycans Creek. Yes, this one is right there at the start of Lycans Creek. You're just over mm -hmm. the railroad tracks. It's the first house that comes up on your right. And this one I wanted to bring on again because they have changed it over for sale or lease. Right, so whether you want to you know, go ahead and pull the trigger and buy it or you mm -hmm. want to lease it, this seller is saying, hey, we're open to, to either opportunity. This is one that I really think has a lot of curb appeal. It's very attractive from the street. And then on the inside, it's the same way. I mean, they've mm -hmm. put in new hardwood flooring. They've opened it up a little bit from the living to the dining room, added some built-ins. So it's had a lot of updates and a lot of just it's got a lot of potential for whatever you would want to do with it. And I love how you included the picture of the pool because mm -hmm. this time of year we're in the winter time. <laughs> you know people are fantasizing about that pool in the summer so you can go ahead and get everything started now by the time you get everything financed and done and moved in. Hey, it's time to start getting that pool ready. I was going to say close to pool season. It's got that wraparound deck that goes yes. all the way from the front to the back so you can enjoy that at the same time as enjoying the pool. And then the bonus to this one is it does have a crawl space under it, but it's a little bit of an extended crawl that mm -hmm. allows you to actually use it for storage. The seller actually had a workshop down there for uh, woodworking, so you've got a lot of space down there for extra. Plus you're right there with Pikeville Commons, mm -hmm. Thompson Road, the, the, all the shopping and dining, the newest area that in Pikeville that is, continues to grow. You're right there, but because you're just across the railroad tracks and around that first curve, you don't know any of that is within half a mile of you. Exactly, exactly. 
All right, this is one, like you said, a lot of people are going to look at plus now. If you couldn't maybe purchase before, but now you're thinking, oh, wait, but I could possibly lease this. Uh, the Pikeville office, and you guys are handling this one. Let's mm -hmm. give your email address. Okay, the email is jbrown at rbnw.com. And the price on that one, 179 so everything under 180000 uh, So that one is also attractive. Now, let's stay on Thompson Road. Mm -hmm. You don't even have to get back out on US 23 to see this next listing. It's at Quail Ridge. Yes, this one, the actual address is 182 Meadowview Lane. And if you're familiar with Quail Ridge, this is going to be the street that actually kind of runs parallel uh, along with the railroad tracks. Right. So we say Quail Ridge mm -hmm. and a lot of people think, oh, I know that hill. That hill is steep. Well, you're getting that community in that area, but you're at the bottom. Right, right. You're at the bottom of the hill. You never have to, to actually go up. The uh, house is a big house. It's mm -hmm. almost 2,500 square feet. And they've just done, in the last couple of years, granite countertops, newer appliances. Mm -hmm. So you can tell that kitchen is very modern, very updated. Right. Like you said, 2,500 square feet. But on the outside, you're almost on a full acre. Mm -hmm. Um, so this is one, if you've driven Thompson Road, you've probably seen this, but well, now you have the opportunity to own this house. Exactly. And the great thing about it, which you mentioned on the outside having a, um, almost an acre, it also has a three-car garage, wow. which is also a little bit atypical, all that extra space. So yeah, you've got your yard space and you've got your garage space mm -hmm. in addition to your living space on the inside of the house. So. Uh, and we talked about a minute ago the Thompson Road area when mm -hmm. you've got the Pikeville Commons area. So you've got all this shopping and the dining. This is also a popular area for people who like to get out and be active. Mm -hmm. So whether you run or you walk, you ride your bicycle, you can access across the Poly Bridge and, and be in, you know, in downtown Pikeville in no time without even having to get out on US 23 if you like the active lifestyle. Absolutely, this is a great location for that. Um, and like you said, a great location just for all the conveniences of right there being on Cassidy Boulevard. Right, so this one's at Quail Ridge. Um, Jennifer, this is your listing. Mm -hmm. The price on this one, 389. Mm -hmm. So you're getting everything under 400,000 uh, for the square footage, the yard space, and the, and the area, the location. Not a bad price for everything you're getting. It's not. And they can feel free to call the Pikeville office for more information. Mm -hmm. If I'm not available, feel free to talk to any of our agents that are there. The number is 606-437-2333. All right. Now, the, uh, the uh, other listing that we're going to talk about is also close to that, but you would mm -hmm. have to get out on 23 to mm -hmm. drive it. Uh, now, this is Northmont, which a lot of people realize is close to a, on the hill above the Bowles Edition. Correct. It's right above the Bowles Edition. This one is actually on Northmont Point, which is if you go up the hill towards Northmont, it's going to be your first left turn. Mm -hmm. um, and it sits in a very private location, which is odd to say because you're on the first street of the subdivision, so it doesn't really make sense how it can be private, but trust me, it is. So this is one that you really need to see to actually grasp how you get the privacy and the way that it's situated up there. Now this one, uh, four bedrooms, four and a half bathrooms, so you've got a lot of space, uh, but you're looking at oh, more than 4,200 square feet. So this is a huge house uh, with room to do whatever you want. Yes, it has space for everything. And the great thing about this one is it has all those formal areas. So you've got mm -hmm. the formal living room, you've got the formal dining room. It actually has kind of a formal office with built-in shelving. And then you also have a family room that is very comfortable with the fireplace and all that. So this is one that you have more of an entertaining house. You have all that space for entertaining, large family, anything like that. And on the outside, speaking of entertaining, inviting friends over to swim in the pool. Mm -hmm. uh, you've you've kind of snuck another one in there. I think you personally <laughs> may already be dreaming of summer. A little bit. <laughs> uh, so we've got a couple of, of listings with pools. But this is a beautiful pool with the decking all the way around it mm -hmm. uh, with the slide that you can see. So... Again, another one that even though it's winter now, you can start dreaming about getting in this one and just in time for summer. Absolutely. And then one of the major amenities with this one is it does have a first floor bedroom. Oh, so wow. mm -hmm. one of those bedrooms, um, of the four bedrooms, is actually on the first floor, which I know a lot of people are looking for. So that's something to actually take into consideration. Right. And then, but then you've got the space, you've got the two story foyer, so mm -hmm. you've got that a lot of people love that entryway when mm -hmm. you walk in and you see the big fancy entryway this has this has everything it does this house <laughs> has everything 589 is the price this one's on Northmont 
Um, but give Jennifer a call. You guys can schedule a showing to where people can get, because it's a gated area, so I'm not sure that it's accessible all the time. It's not. A lot of times during the week you can um, mm -hmm. access to do a drive-by, but most of the time, the time frame that you're going to be doing a drive-by, it may be shut. Okay. So this one's one that you can arrange. Mm -hmm. So let's give the uh, Pikeville office number. Okay. Number 606-437-2333. All right, now the last one that we're going to mention today uh, is outside the city limits of mm -hmm. Pikeville. It's actually technically an Elkhorn City address, but it's really on Marbone. Yes, it is on Marbone, and the best thing about this one is that new road that's come through mm -hmm. has put this one in a great location. So you're only about two miles off the brand new road that's going Pikeville, and we'll end up in Elkhorn City when it is all the way open. Right. So. This was one that even though that road's not open all the way through to Elkhorn City and into Virginia, it is open far enough to mm -hmm. be able to access this home. So what normally could have been a 30 minute drive from Pikeville is now probably 15. Yeah, yeah, it's literally half the time to get to this house. And this is in a really good neighborhood as you go up through there. It's in a nice little um, street kind of off the main road of mm -hmm. Marbone. It's actually called Huffman Street if you want to do a drive by on it. And this house, it's an older house built in the 60s, but has been so well maintained and taken care of. You would never know that it was built in the 60s by that first picture that mm -hmm. we show. The curb appeal on this one is great. You've got the front yard, uh, you've got the, the columns on the front porch, so it's very inviting from the outside. And that's before we ever step foot inside. Exactly, and then you can go to the picture of that formal living room that backs up to the formal dining room. Uh -huh. You can see the fireplace. On the other side of that room is a den that has that fireplace, but it's actually a floor-to-ceiling brick fireplace. Very wow. pretty very comfortable feeling house, mm -hmm. but it's also one that has a ton of space. You can tell from that front picture, they actually took a garage and made yes. it into a family room and then added on another garage. So you have all that extra space. So yeah, this one is one that, that I think is gonna get a lot of attention, uh, mainly because you're getting this, you're, you're in Marybone, you're close mm -hmm. to Elkhorn City, so you're getting the country feel, but with the new road, your accessibility to Pikeville and US 23, uh, is is very quicker than you would have ever imagined in this neighborhood. Exactly. And then the new thing on this one is they will, again, sell it or they are open to leasing it. Wow. So that's two that we sh featured today mm -hmm. that could purchase or lease. So uh, with if you're in the market to lease, maybe not ready to buy yet, this will be one that, that you could lease and then maybe potentially buy mm -hmm. at some point. Absolutely. So, yeah, we've given you five different listings um, with a lot of different options and, and areas and locations mm -hmm. today. Uh, Jennifer, most of these or all of these are your listings, so let's throw your email address out there one more time. Okay, it's jbrown at rbnw.com, but again, if they call the office, feel free to talk to any of our agents about the listings. Okay, this or any other listing? Absolutely. All right. I'm going to step out now and let you talk about options for the new year. Happy New Year! With the new year comes new goals, and the agents of Rare Brown & Williams hope that home ownership is on the top of your goal list. There are some habits that might help that goal become a reality. First, work on saving for your down payment. This may mean cutting out an expensive vacation or eating out less. You can even open a special home savings account to keep that money separate from your daily spending money. Second, start planning ahead and familiarize yourself with the cost of owning a home. Whether you're currently renting or living with family, notice the expenses, maintenance, and unexpected repairs and costs. This will give you an idea of what to expect when you are a homeowner. If 2019 is the year you plan to purchase a home, please call your local Red Brown & Williams Real Estate Office to find an agent ready to help you with your search. Thank you for joining us for today's show. We hope you'll join us again soon.